It's a beautiful day out there. Time to explore. We recently did a tour of the Gila Cliff Dwellings. And while we were there, um, we saw a sign for a short little trail where they had some petroglyphs and a possible cave dwelling. And for me, you've seen one petroglyph, you've seen them all. But I could kind of tell Melody wanted to take this tour or take this little walk. So uh, to make her happy, we decided to go down to Lower Scorpion Campground and take a little walk, see a um, dwelling that was built into a cave and see some petroglyphs. And in the end, I'm glad I did because I found out not all petroglyphs are the same. So I hope you enjoy the video. Okay, we're in Lower Scorpion Campground at Gila National Monument. Supposed to be a little trail here, trail to the pass. Supposed to see some petroglyphs and some ruins. It's only like a half mile, so we thought we'd check it out. And it's listed as a very easy hike. I think it's that eighth mile to the petroglyphs, quarter mile to the ruins, something like that. Let you know. Unfortunately, there was a, you could go left or you could go right at the spot we were just videoing. We're going left. Hopefully we picked the right one. Well, I think we picked the right direction. Yes, the famous ones are the Gila Cliff Dwellings. But all through this area, you can find remnants of dwellings like this. There seems to be two rooms. I'm trying to lean in here. Room one, room two, if you can see. And there's the surrounding view. Now it does seem, if I come over here, that. It's kind of cool looking up through here. That with the rains, it does look an awful lot like an arroyo or a wash, whatever you want to call it. And I think I did see water down below. So you can see why somebody wants to stay here. So, if you're a healer, uh, yes, there's, ah, she just doesn't like to be in my videos. Without her, these videos wouldn't be possible. Um, for the Gila, uh, dwellings, and you just want a little side trip. And I'll put my, the link to my, uh, trip, the trip we took to the dwellings. A little windows, a little, uh, walk up here. Short, but a little steep. And we just did the cave dwellings. Uh, nice little side trip. Uh, you got a little campground in there. I think the campground is just for tents, not for RVs or anything, and picnic tables. So this would be a really nice place to picnic. And if we 
find the petroglyphs, I'll add this to the video. And what I'm guessing is, it said it was, there was something up at the trailhead for the cliff dwellings. And it said, eighth mile to the petroglyph panel, quarter mile to the shelter, the cave shelter. So I said a little while ago, we could go left or right. We went left and went to the cave shelter. So I got thinking, well, maybe they just weren't that explicit with the directions that if you go right for an eighth of a mile, you'll find the petroglyphs. And if this makes it to the final edit, I was correct. And I was correct. Made a little while down the road. Now the sun's behind me. So I'm hoping this will start showing up. That this red on tan are the petroglyphs. They're really even hard to see without the sun. I come back a little. Now those seem to be a little better. Oh, going up here. Yeah, it's gorgeous. You have more. You can make them out. Even way up high there. Now hopefully, as I said, I get the sun a little behind me, right, or on top of me, basically. So it's hard to tell if any of this will show up. But if it does, I'll be in the video. And since I mentioned Little Scorpion Campground, for anybody who's interested, I thought I'd give you a little look. Um, picnic table, fire pit, grill, picnic table, fire pit, grill. Oh, it looks like this one, somebody left some wood in it. Yeah, how nice of them. I guess, yeah, I'll go check the sign. If I'm wrong, I'll let you know. It looks like you pop a tent down right here. They do have pit toilets. And I'll go check out any rags and I'll put them in the description. So I'm counting one, two, just looking around. Looks like there's places for two tent people to tent camp. And that's the campground. At least I'm not seeing any more trails. See a sign up here, what does it say? Uh, do not travel, they don't want you going up there. So I guess that's it. Two campsites. And as I said, I'll check out the details, whether they charge or anything. But uh, yeah, better be bringing tents. Well, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, taking a look at what we saw. Uh, my recommendation for this place would be if you do the cliff dwellings, bring a picnic lunch with you. Drive down to Lower Scorpion Campground. They have picnic tables there. And we didn't see anybody camping. And there's a pit toilet, etc. Um, have a picnic, relax from after doing the cliff dwellings, and then take a little hike up to uh, the cave, take a hike in the opposite direction down to the petroglyphs. Be a nice little walk through history. So I hope you enjoyed the video. If so, the usual, please think about subscribing, thumbs up, notification bell, leave comments, and wishing you a blessed day.